How to cook easy homemade pita bread. Time to make 8 6 inch diameter loaves approximately 2 hours. Is it worth the effort to make pita at home? Absolutely. Pita bread, like store bought sandwich bread, is frequently several days old. Warm, fragrant home baked pita is clearly superior, and the breads puff up in the oven, which is a bit of a thrill. It's not tough once you get the hang of it. Get freshly milled whole wheat flour for the greatest flavor. Even though the recipe only calls for a small amount, it makes a difference. Ingredients 2 tablespoon dry active yeast 35 grams whole wheat flour, 1 fourth cup, preferably freshly milled 12 teaspoon sugar 2 and a half cups unbleached all-purpose flour, 310 grams 1 teaspoon salt, kosher 2 tablespoons extra virgin olive oil Preparation How to make a sponge, in a large mixing basin, pour 1 cup of lukewarm water Mix in the yeast and sugar To dissolve, stir the ingredients together Whisk together the whole wheat flour and 1 fourth cup all-purpose flour Area bowl in a warm, not hot, place, uncovered, for 15 minutes, or until mixture is frothy and bubbling Salt, olive oil, and almost all of the remaining all-purpose flour, save one half cup, are mixed in. Stir the ingredients with a wooden spoon or chopsticks until it becomes a shaggy pile. Dust with a little of the saved flour, then knead for one minute in the bowl, including any dry bits. Place the dough on a work surface. Lightly knead about two minutes, or until smooth. Cover and set aside for 10 minutes before kneading for another 2 minutes. Avoid using too much of the saved flour, the dough should be soft and wet. At this point, the dough can be chilled for several hours or overnight in a large zipped plastic bag. Return the dough to room temperature, knead it into a ball, and continue with the procedure. Return the dough to the mixing bowl after cleaning it. Wrap plastic wrap around the bowl and then cover with a cloth. Place the bowl in a warm, but not hot, location. Allow one hour for the dough to double in bulk. Preheat the oven to 475 degrees Fahrenheit. Place a heavy-duty baking sheet, large cast iron pan, or ceramic baking tile on the lowest shelf of the oven. Punch down the dough and divide it into eight equal-sized pieces. Make a little ball out of each component. Cover dough balls with a moist towel and set aside for 10 minutes. Remove one ball and roll it into a flat disc with a rolling pin, keeping the others covered. Roll out to a 6-inch circle, then to an 8-inch diameter, about 1 8 inch thick, flouring as needed. The dough will shrink slightly while it bakes. Carefully pull the dough circle and set it on the hot baking sheet as soon as possible. The dough should be pleasantly puffed after 2 minutes. Turn with tongs or a spatula and bake for another minute. Only a few brown speckles should be visible on the pita. Warm pita bread should be placed in a napkin-lined basket and covered to keep it soft. Continue with the remaining dough balls. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more videos, and support vulnerable children in Uganda.